Hi, in this tutorial, I will explain how we can create dynamic charts in Excel. Here we can see that I have some data of sales for 2008 to 2013 for seven products. And for product one, these are the sales figures. For product two, these are the sales figures. I have a combo box here and if I select product 1 then this is the chart for product 1 if I select product 2 then all the numbers are automatically changing for product 3 numbers are changing so this is how we can select any product and numbers for that product will be used for this chart so how can we create this kind of dynamic chart? So let me explain you step by step. What I will do, I will copy the data on a new sheet. Then I will go to developer tab and insert. Here we have form controls and ActiveX control. I will select form control and in form control, I will select combo box. Then I will drag a combo box here. Now I will right click on combo box and select format control. In this window, in input range, I will select the list of product for cell link I will select any cell or maybe I will select here 11th row cell in A column then I will click OK now if I select this arrow in combo box and select any product like product 1 then the cell which we have incorporated for this as a link will show us the value if I select product 2 then it is showing as 2 so on the change of item in combo box value is changing in, in the link cell now what is the next task I will select a cell here let me highlight this cell and I will use the formula index ok let me change the font color also is equal to index open parenthesis now index function requires two parameters if we are using index in a simple way first thing is array or the list so I will select the list of product then comma then column number for column number I will select this cell which is attached with the combo box and I will click or close the parenthesis enter now check the combo box again if I select product 1 then link cell is showing 1 and formula of index is showing also product 1 now I will copy here, paste here, now I can see that I have index formula here, I will freeze the A11 because this is the column parameter in index function, 
I will select here and F4 or dollar sign. So this is how we can freeze a cell. I will enter and I will drag the formula towards right. Now we can create a chart. I will select this range. Remember, we need not to select this cell which is linked to combo box. Now I will go to insert tab. Then we can select any chart as per your data or as per your need. Let me select any chart and I can drag this chart. We have different options available with Excel to give a style or chart. You can select anyone. And I will delete this. Maybe you can delete title as well or anything. Formatting can be done in any way. Now we are ready with the dynamic chart. So let me check if I select product 2, then link cell is also changing the value. Here we can also see the changed value and here numbers are also changed and in the last what we can do is we can select the range where we have data for the chart and no fill in background font color also white here I will click here this is occurring because format of cell is not number. If it is number in your sheet, it will not give any message. Now you can select any product and you can visualize the chart with the relevant data. Sometimes what happens like we are watching our video but image is not clear so what we can do is in our youtube video we can change or we can ensure that quality at this point is set to 360 or above so thank you for watching this video if you like this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos in easy steps